News Storm Team. Welcome back to KX News at 6. Let's go ahead and show our current storm team radar this afternoon. Seeing clear skies here for us once again today. Going to stay dry overnight tonight and clear through tomorrow and pretty much for the rest of the week as well. Temperatures right now holding in those 70s back towards the east, seeing an 82 in Minot, getting warmer out towards the west, seeing an 88 in Watford City, 93 out towards Sydney, and 99 in the Wolf Point area. So a bit toasty out across the western tier of the state here for us today. Going to be getting hotter and hotter though, especially as we get into tomorrow into Thursday as well. Those dew points are holding in those 60s for pretty much all of us right now in our central and northwestern locations. So again, that mugginess factor is certainly there once again here for us today. Going to be seeing that once again tomorrow, Thursday, Friday, and into the weekend. So hot, hazy, and humid are the three H's to remember here for us the next few days. Here's your State Fair forecast brought to you by Scott Answer Casino and Resort. Looking ahead to tomorrow, 91 degrees for that forecast high, 98 for Thursday, and 96 for Friday. So getting hotter and hotter as you progress into the late stages of the fair here for us this week. Not seeing much in the way of a chance for rain, so that is some good news here for us the next few days. But overall, definitely need some water and some shade if you're going to go out to the fair really tomorrow through Friday. Looking ahead to tomorrow, pretty widespread 100s out across the western tier of the state. 100 for Dickinson, 107 for Sydney. Wolf Point, what in the world are you doing? 108 for that forecast high. And again, being hot down towards Hedinger and Bowman as well. Seeing those 90s in our central areas and mid 80s back towards the east. As you push along into Thursday, probably the hottest day of the week here for us. Widespread 90s back towards our eastern areas. Getting near 100 for the capital city. Same for Minot. And again, seeing those 100s out towards the west. 103 for Williston. 106 for Beach. So it's going to be pretty darn toasty here for us the next few days. A little bit of reprieve working in beginning as early as Friday. Just seeing those 80s and 90s returning there for us. Looking at our precision cast right now. Again, staying dry here for us tonight. Staying dry clear through the tomorrow through Thursday. May see some showers or storms possibly developing on Friday afternoon and evening beginning out towards the west. We'll keep our eye on that over the next few days. Let you know more about it as we get closer on to the end of the week. Our air quality index again shows most of the state right now in the unhealthy for sensitive groups range. We do have a bit of an unhealthy risk up towards the Williston area right now. And again, due to those due to those wildfires up towards Canada, we'll be seeing that smoke lingering here for us the next few days. So again, hot, humid and hazy again because of that smoke. Looking at our mosquito meter here brought to you by Northern Testing. Looking ahead through tonight into Wednesday and Thursday. No surprise there, a high chance for mosquitoes. It's humid, it's hot, it's the summer. Expect those things to be around here for us for the next few weeks at least. Looking at Williston's five-day forecast. Getting into those triple digits there tomorrow. And again on Thursday, 103 is that forecast high for Thursday. Overnight lows, in fact, staying in those 70s. Very unusual for here this time of year even. And again, staying in those 80s and 90s clear through the weekend. Dickinson's five-day. 100 for tomorrow on 104 there for us on Thursday and then a nice cool crisp 93 for Friday. So a little bit of a reprieve, but still quite hot here for us overall the next five days. Looking at my not seven day forecast tomorrow, 91, 98 for Thursday and 96 to wrap up or begin to wrap up the fair there for us at the end of the week. And again, staying in those 80s to the beginning stages of next week. So quite mild and humid as well for the next several days overall. And Bismarck getting near 100 for Thursday, 95 for Friday. Again, watching those storm chances for Friday, Saturday and Sunday. We'll see what happens as we get closer on into the weekend. Look at that. We get to feel like Arizona for a, day, for, for a day or two. Yeah, Arizona with the heat and New Orleans with the humidity or the East Coast. We got a little bit of everything. No snow, so that, that's the one positive yep. note. No real yeah. winds either. Maybe some 15 or 20s heading into tomorrow, but hot and humid here the next several days. So it's uh, between the ice cream and the lemonade. Those are going to be hot sellers at the fair for tomorrow. For sure. Good for them, the vendors <laughs> out there, because they're going to be selling the hotcakes. Kenny, thank you so much, and stay with us.